I don't see you on a regular, but I see you screaming, Van. <sighs> this, like, this is crazy. This is what they did. This is what they did to us. Little Duck have been arrested in connection to a King Van get back to do with Quando Rondo's cousin and the situation we also played out. They have arrested Little Duck in Florida and he's currently in the cells now due to someone actually implementing him in the situation. One of his close friends wore a wire and the thing about this is he actually predicted this in one of his songs saying that, you know, the person is going to look him on the stand and act like they don't know him and there's no point getting a lawyer if his close friend told on him. So it's crazy. Like... At this point, it's loads of mixed emotions. What does this really solve? After Little Duck could have been used as a vessel to help the community and he was on his way to changing the community and everything. And I mean, you know, people talk about how he changed the whole of old block and they're all praying and everything now. You know, he went this different path, did all this stuff to try and change his life. Now they've come and got him and he's back at square one, like all these problems. And that's the thing, like when you dwell in evil, evil will follow you. And this is a perfect example of it. All the people that has died around him know this stuff. Like, you know, he was getting the right help that he needed to get out of the hood, to get out of the situation while having the voice and the opportunity to bring other people with him. And this is where the problem comes in because it's all a cycle. Because remember, they let that stuff happen. These people, the stuff that happened with the people in Chicago, these people let it happen. It starts with the public housing and, you know, every time it goes bad, they demolish it and try to change it around. But somehow the same thing keeps happening. So now Little Duck is in a position where he could change the community. And at the same time, his father being who he is, Larry Hoover, that's where the issue comes in. Too much power too much power and they went around it and tried and everything and it just so happened that this person who told on little Dirk, they did it to avoid a 12-year sentence they traded little Dirk to avoid a 12-year sentence this is crazy they let all this stuff played out and now it almost feels like they're following the money and all this money that little duck have is like they're somehow gonna try and seize it they're somehow gonna try and take it from him and it even starts with the lawsuit as well that mama duck currently has on him so that's alongside with if a higher case like He's going to be doing some sort of time. Like, I don't think any lawyer or anything can get him out now. Dirk and Vaughn. Like, it is crazy. People are now saying Dirk gave up his life for King Vaughn. And, I mean, that is a lot. Like, that is a lot to say. Because everyone was in it to get something out of it. Everyone's saying that Quando Rondo is not worth losing Dirk and Vaughn over. This is what it got down to. And the main thing around the situation is the energy that they put out, the energy that was being put out. And little Dirk, even though he tried to escape that energy, tried to change his life and everything, it's still coming back on him. And now he's in the cell right now. And no one's happy about this. Like, no one's happy about this because at the same time now he is someone who can make a change to the community do a lot for the community but somehow it's not going to happen like they will not let it happen they want the cycle to continue they want the killings to continue whenever someone comes in that has the power like a larry hoover and stuff and remember even this as well him being linked to larry hoover and all of it and the person who they tried to get down for time and they ended up getting down larry hoover is still inside this so the people that he's connected to is just too much power like they can't have him if he's not going to continue the cycle if he's not going to continue let in the stuff happen in the streets and when it comes to like you know the religion and all the stuff right that they've been ushered in and everything that could possibly play a part in it because again it's a change it's some sort of change so they're not outside everyone's praying now they're not trying to go outside and doing the drilling and all this stuff so it doesn't really benefit the people who are letting the cycle continue who know about the public housing 
person and the problems that it caused the energy still lingers around the cycle is going to continue at this point they're building houses new apartments new public housing on graveyards the reality of the situation and now it looks like they're trying to get rid of otf the whole otf crew they are going to try and implement them and get them down but they've got the main person now who is at this power level of a larry hoover and this is what i think everyone needs to pay attention to because little dirk right now he has all this money he has all this power and what do they do to black people that have money and power they lock them up they try to make them look crazy they try to make them sound crazy even though the lawyers can defend him when it comes to the stuff that he talks about in the music when it comes to the this and all the things that was happening at the time they let it happen they watch it happen then years down the line when he's trying to actually change the community and change the whole perception of everything that was going on and letting people see this is what we're going through this is how many people that have died around us look at all the names on the stage look at everyone everyone needs to come together him trying to bring jay main king yellow all this stuff trying to do all this work right so the community can change you have these people that will come and dig up all this stuff and try to get them down because why it's just like a nipsey hustle it's just like a tupac it's just like a biggie small all these other people who had some huge power status in the community they are now locked away larry hoover they are now dead somehow they have been set up all this stuff has happened to them because they were on a path of actually changing people they have the power to change many minds to change the minds of people and when they were doing the dissonant stuff they let the dissonant and all of it happen because that's what they wanted to see this is what they want the community to be in this bubble of the sick depression state where you know you have to deal with the with the stages of grief and different things and then it's one person after the next and people that you don't even know but you care about attached to these people whether it's in the music whether it's their personal life whether you relate in whatever way this is all the trap this is all part of the setup and now they try to demolish the blocks and everything talk about their breaking down old block and all this stuff but if they demolish old block all they're going to do is build another public housing on a graveyard like they've done before many times in the past. Because when you look at the history of Chicago and all the housing and all, and all the public housings that have been demolished, a lot of bad things has happened there. A lot of bad energy linger around these places and that's what's happened so little Dirk is currently in the cell he's been arrested and could you imagine being under these people and having all this power how would he be treated what would they do to him will he end up being a ynw melly like how they be treating ynw melly and stuff would they try to do that just because he have some sort of power look at what they did to larry hoover no one could have visited him and they were actually pretending to search people while they were putting secret wiretaps on them to go and visit larry hoover ynw melly can't even get a phone call now little dirk is in that same place where his dad was where his uncle was all the work that they did on him to try and save him from the streets this is where he is right now back at square one because of all the energy he was involved in and the places that the demonic music led him it's still like you know it still lingers right there and all we got to do is pray for little duck because at the same time we do not want to lose little duck and king van he comes with king van van comes with little duck like it's a lot do you guys think with little duck having all this money and the best lawyers access to the best lawyers and everything will he get out on bond will they let him out and if they do let him out after all of this will he be able to make the change that is needed for the community some sort of activist for all this power he has with the voice that he has and everything will they let him become an activist or will they go out of their way to make sure this does not happen